Do you want to create images for your AI influencer model for absolutely free? So yeah, you guys have come to the right place because in this video, I'm going to introduce you guys to a new tool which is Focus AI. So this tool right here can really help you with amazing features like consistent corrector and in pad or out paint. So without further ado, let's just explore this tool and see how it can help you create those amazing images for your AI influencer model, all right? All right, so for that, first of all, you need to go ahead and go to Google, type in Focus Collab, and you don't know, just click on the first link, Google Collab Official. And here you go, uh, there you are in your uh, Google Collab notebook. And after that, just need to go ahead and click on this connect first of all. So this will connect your Collab to your TPU. And after that, uh, when it's connected, you simply go ahead and run this cell, all right? Click on run anyway. So this will uh, take some time to download some of the important requirements. So I just need to go ahead and wait for that. All right, so after everything is downloaded and ready to go, so you just need to go ahead and click on this running on public URL. This will provide you the link. You just need to open this up and this will open up the Focus AI for you guys. All right, guys, so after that, this will basically uh, be the interface for Focus AI. So you guys can see from here, like I've been using it uh, for quite some time now, and these were my last creations. So this is a very uh, innovative interface where you can see we have the box for our image output, then we have our prompt input, and then we have few more options, which are input image and advanced. So if you click on this advanced button right over here, so this will open up few of the more settings and parameters. So you have access to lots of different options. So first of all, we have settings so in which you can choose performance. You can choose between speed, quality, or extreme speed. So for that, I think uh, you should select speed. So that will give you a neutral uh, result, like more like quality and speed at the same time, okay? Then you have aspect ratio. So you can choose between lots of aspect ratios for your images. Then we have image number. So whether you want like one, two, three, four, how many images, you can select that. Then output format, so wow. So it basically provides you the output format as well. You can select between PNG, JPG, and WebP, all right? Then uh, we have negative prompt. So you can choose uh, what you don't want to see in your image. So you can type negative prompt right over here. Then we have the seed number. If you unclick that, so you can choose uh, your seed as well for your images, which is really, really good, okay? So then uh, we have the option of style. So you can go ahead and choose between lots of styles that Focus AI offers you. Then we have models, so you can go ahead and choose models. So for that, I'm gonna go ahead and choose everything as neutral and we're gonna go ahead and create consistent style and our AI influencer with the help of this Focus AI, right? So yeah, uh, previously these all features, you can go ahead and do that with different tools. You can do it consistent style with Midjourney. You can create images with Leonardo or Midjourney itself. But now you can do that all with the help of this tool right here, okay? So first of all, I'm gonna go ahead and type in my prompt for our AI influencer image, which is gonna be realistic portrait in soft light of a lady with green hair and light freckles. Um, her gray eyes full of joy captured in hyper detailed photography, right? And for that, you can go ahead and choose style. So we are doing a hyper detailed photography. So we're gonna go ahead and do focus photograph. All right, and now I'm gonna go ahead and click generate for the number of images. I think four looks good. And for the aspect ratio, yeah, nine by seven looks absolutely perfect, right? So I'm just gonna go ahead and click generate. And then it will go ahead and download a few models. And wow, take a look at the speed of this thing. Yeah, this tool is creating images for you in real time. So our first one is done, which is looks really, really good. Then it's processing the second one for us as well. And it's done too. Then we have the third one in working too. Done. And now uh, the fourth one as well. All right. All right, guys. So here are our four results for our AI influencer, which was realistic portrait in soft light of a lady with green hair and light freckles. So if you take a look at these images. So I think uh, in these images, uh, I'm very much seeing lots of freckle face for the model. So if I can go ahead and exclude light freckles in my prompt, and I'm gonna go ahead and run this prompt once again and see how much of a difference it's gonna make by just excluding uh, the light freckles, all right? All right, guys, so now take a look at these images. Wow, now these images are absolutely perfect, like very natural detail, uh, like everything is to the mark, right? Especially, I'm very much liking the third image as well as the fourth image, okay? 
So yeah, now what we're going to do is we're going to choose one of these images as our AI Instagram influencer, okay? So let's just say I'm going to finalize this image right over here, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and save it for now. All right, so it is saved. And then with the help of this Rappens image or this AI Instagram influencer, I'm going to go ahead and create different variations. Like I'm going to use consistent corrector feature in Focus AI. And we're going to go ahead and create as many images and you can run your Instagram account with the help of this AI influence, right? So for that, if you want to go ahead and generate consistent characters, you need to click on this input image. All right. And this will basically go ahead and open a few more options. So first of all, you can upscale or variation. Then we have image prompt, input or outpaint, describe metadata, right? So if you want to go ahead and use consistent character, you need to select this image prompt right over here. All right. And after that, I'm going to go ahead and paste the reference image of my AI influencer model. Okay, so it's uploaded. And after that, you need to go ahead and access these buttons right over here. Okay, so you can easily do that by clicking on this advanced button right over here. Okay, okay. And on that, you need to click on this face swap button. So yeah, now whatever prompt you're going to create is going to face swap your reference image to that new prompt image. Okay. So yeah, now I'm going to go ahead and change my prompt and we'll create basically a half body shots and full body shots in different style, different clothing, different background, just to, you know, have variation uh, in our images so that we can upload it for our AI influencer in Instagram. Uh, but it's very important that our model, our face is going to remain same because obviously it will be for one single person. All right. So first of all, I'm going to go ahead and type in my prompt, which is going to be realistic hyper detail portrait in a soft light of a lady with blue hair, her gray eyes reflecting joy. She's dressed in a classy evening gown for a half body shot with a green chandelier in the back or adding a touch of elegance. All right. So yeah, uh, now we have changed uh, the color, which was going to be blue because yeah, obviously you can do that. So yeah, our face is going to uh, be the same for that as well. So yeah, now let's just go ahead and generate these images and we're going to see how they're going to turn out for our this reference image, okay? All right, wow. So take a look at these results. So we have real estate hyper detailed portrait in a soft light of a lady with blue hair, her gray eyes reflecting joy and all those details and take a look at the results. So this was our reference image right over here and with the help of that, you can go ahead and tweak your prompts and create different variations of your image. So first of all, we have this image. Then the second variation, we have uh, this image, which looks really, really good. Then we have the third one as this one. And the fourth image is going to be this. Wow. So these variations are really, really good. Like you can go ahead and compare these images. These are literally the same person, but now with blue here, uh, with different setting in the background, with different dress and all those details. Okay. So now let's just go ahead and do uh, one more thing. This time I'm going to go ahead and do like full body shot and see like what kind of variation we can get and whether they'll be good enough to upload that on our socials. All right, wow. So take a look at these results. Okay, yeah, these look absolutely perfect. So now we have full body shot of a radiant lady with blue hair and gray eyes, obviously, which was our Instagram AI model, wearing a flowing summer maxi dress against the backdrop of a vibrant cityscape. So now take a look at these images. All right. Yeah. So these look absolutely perfect. You guys can see we have all the details. Our AI Instagram model is the same as you guys can see right over here. And then if you see our last image, so if you compare that with our reference ones, yeah, these look absolutely perfect. We have a uh, change color eyes. So you can do that obviously by wearing contacts. But other than that, all the details, everything, uh, this looks up to the mark. Okay, so now you can go ahead and generate different variations by tweaking your prompt and, you know, get posted on your Instagram for your AI influencer. Okay. All right. So now I'm going to go ahead and do one more example for our full body shot. And this time I'm going to say soft light illuminates a fashionable lady with blue hair and gray eyes. Her adding charm to her big smile. She's wearing a boho chic outfit captured in a full body shot against a rustic countryside background. Okay. So now let's just go ahead and generate these images and see how they're going to turn out. Okay. All right. So take a look at these images. Wow. These are really, really good. So we have now four uh, different variations for our reference image. So yeah, uh, these images looked really, really good, especially the last one and the second last one as well, right? All right, so another cool feature uh, that you can use in Focus AI is in paint or out paint. Okay, so for that, 
you can go ahead and go to this in paid or out paid options so over here uh, you can draw basically things that can be like jewelry or anything like that and make your uh, like images more and more impressive okay so let's just say i go ahead and upload any image over here let's just uh, go for this one and now i want to go ahead and add a locket or some kind of a necklace uh in this image okay so for that i'm gonna go ahead and paint like wherever i want that to be let's just go ahead and do right over here all right this looks good and now uh, in the prompt i can simply go ahead and type dark black locket okay all right so here we go guys yeah this look really really good looking at the vibe like she's wearing she's wearing a black leather jacket and for that uh this accessory is looking absolutely perfect here especially the first one as well as this one and the last one looks really really good right so there you have it guys this was uh the exploration of focus ai like how you can do consistent character that is basically a very a new feature image journey too so you can do that in focus ai with free without paying anything and how you can create your own ai instagram influencer all right so yeah hope you like this video and i'll see you in the next one until then take care bye bye